What's up, City Gang? It's your girl today. I'm back with another video. And by the title, you guys can see that I am about to react to the things that Southerners say at the county fair. So before we get to it, make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe. And without further ado, guys, let's get straight into the video. I love the smell of fairs. Popcorn, cotton candy, fried food, poop. Oh, no, that's horse food. Oh, oh don't step in it. Oh, no, now you got to throw your shoes away. I chose this fair specifically for the bump cars. They have a lack of seat belts and they get up to 30 miles per hour. I've got pet test, dairy pills, and pets of complete. I've been looking forward to this for months. The ticket situation is so complicated. You get seven ride tickets for the price of five if you bought them ahead of time for some elementary school kid. You guys want to ride the Ferris wheel that's held together by rubber bands and Elmer's glue? Okay, before we split up, let's all agree to meet in front of the potato sack slide in one hour. Does everyone have enough cash? The nearest ATM's like 10 miles away. I usually get my bowl of peanuts from Jerry down at the Sock and Chop, but this is the only place where they'll give them to you in a waffle cup. You really want to go to the vendor's booth? It's just going to be some old guy selling patriotic wire art. Boring. We got some new rides this year. We got the neck breaker, body smasher. That one's just called death trap. Let's go. Do the corn dogs seem shorter to you this year? Hold on. Never fall for that world's smallest horse crap. You don't need to wait in line for an hour and pay $45 just to see a geriatric pony. Yes, all the rides are supposed to sound like they're breaking. It's part of the experience. I think. Batter it, drop it in my oil, shove a big old stick in it, and take my money. I slipped a kid operating this ride at 20. The ride won't stop until one of us pukes. My money's on John. What do y'all think they do with those leftover pies for the pie eating contest? Out? Yes, fried cheese. Nope. That's better. Yeah, all of these games are a scam. A scam that I will defeat. That Yoshi doll is coming home with me. Please don't let anybody win a goldfish today. Those 20 trips back and forth from the pet store are not worth it. Hurry up and finish that cotton candy so we can get some supper. Now, do you want the turkey leg or the double fried chicken steak? Okay, if you're in line and you see a couple of teens making out, just cut them. They'll never notice. Trust. Who wants to take Granny home? She got her denture stuck in the candied apples again. Ooh, let's get a caricature made. <laughs> I can't tell if that ride operator is 12 years old or 70. Don't you throw up that funnel cake. We waited in line 30 minutes and I paid $25 for that. Uh, yeah. I see it. I see it. This is good. <laughs> this is good. No, no, no. This is fun. I'm good. Do this over here. I had too many cherry hand pies earlier, and those mean kids over there thought I was a clown. Wait, does every ride here just go in circles over and over again? I don't think I can stand up straight. I don't remember hurting this much when we did this 25 years ago. I can feel my lung collapsing. What? <laughs> Oh my god what okay so i haven't been to a fair in so long because let's just keep it honest the way my body's set up and the way my health is set up so <laughs> i can agree to a lot of what they said though i can't like i feel like if i ever go back to a fair as an adult it's just gonna be like you know like i went to an amusement park in houston and half the rides we did i was just like mm -mm. Mm -mm. nope mm -mm. yeah it just don't hit the same when you get older it don't like it just don't hit the same but so again hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys next time